Well, we gotta get this one up here. Well, hello, friends. Well, it's Sunday afternoon, and I'm off, so you know what that means. It's time to go fishing. I'm gonna spend this afternoon hitting some of these retention slash landscaping ponds along the side of the highway. The one I'm gonna start with today is here in North Myrtle Beach, right around the corner from the Bass Pro Shop. I was just there at Bass Pro, spending way too much money on just a small bag of lures. <coughs> but this water looks just right, so I figure I'll test it out with uh, some of these lures that I bought today. So let's see what we can find. Okay, friends. Here it is, and as you see, this water looks pretty good. It's a nice size pond. It looks clean and deep. Like the kind of place that a bass would like to hang out. I'm going to start out with some top water. Do a little jitter bugging. And I'm also going to throw some Some soft baits. So I'm going to use a Nico leech for one. This definitely looks like the place that I need to bring my uh, float tube down to. Well, there's a, a wading bird, so that tells me that there's at least minnows in here. Alright, fish on. Oh, he threw it. Nope, nope. He's on there. Was on there. Ding dang it. So I know there are fish in here. And yeah, he jumped all over that leech. And I know. That where there's one fish, there's two fish. I thought I had him set pretty good. I'm wondering if he just had the tail of it. All right, fish on. Let's see if we can keep it on this time. He's going to run at me. And that's how he threw it off the last time. Got right up to the surface and threw it. But that seems to be the spot right there. All right. Fish on. Let's keep it on this time. Whoa, that's a big one. Yeah, hey, we got a hog on here. Whoa, go on, go on. <laughs> there we go. Look at that. Look at the bend in that rod. Well, we got to get this one up here. Let's play this one out. Oh! Dag gum. That one was at least three pounds. Lord, friends, that was a great fight. So we we know there are fish in here. Whew. Well, that thing plumb wore me out. I would have really have liked to have gotten a weight on that one. Well, I'm going to check my heart, uh, my heartbeat on that one. That one, whew, it got me going. Let's see here. Yeah, he got me, uh, got me all flustered. 95 beats a minute. Whoa. Okay, I had to go retie a couple of liters. So I put on a Guggen 
bandito bug I'm gonna stick to the bottom because that's where all my hits have been so far I still can't get over losing that that hog and it was a hog when he got up here next to me I, I thought I could stick my foot in his mouth well here we are at the on point animal hospital Thought I'd stop in here and get a little fishing in. Okay, fish on. Okay. Look at you. This guy's fight to him. He jumped all over that whopper plopper. There we go. How he got hooked in the belly, I don't know. But he did. Yeah, nice large mouth. See what this rebel crawl will do. And that one kind of took me by surprise. I, I'd thrown it a few times and kind of lulled away. Okay, friends, I'm going to call it a day. I've got some things to do tonight. Uh, it was a pretty good, uh, a pretty good day all overall. I really liked that uh, that hog that I hooked into there at the. Uh, North Myrtle Beach. I liked it so much in fact that come uh, uh, Come tomorrow if the Lord's willing I'm gonna haul my uh, float tube up there and crawl off in that pond and and uh, do some serious fishing but uh, The uh, The old reliable on-point animal hospital pond behind me here it uh, it proved to be a winner uh, a couple of really nice bass and uh, nice bluegill but uh, I appreciate everybody that's come with me today stay tuned tomorrow let's see how this float tube adventure goes if it goes uh, if you've not subscribed be sure to hit the like and subscribe button and I appreciate everybody who already has hey Jaden hope everything's working out for you this has been hook setting adventures fishing with pudding on the side of highway 17